Yo, what's up, guys? This is Atrix here, back again with a brand new video. Today, we'll be taking a look at the Agena Simulator's brand new version 3.1.6 update. And the funny part about this Agena Simulator update is that when I opened the Play Store page, I saw 2.4 rating and I couldn't stop laughing. I guess it's well deserved. And according to the change log, you'll be able to see they have added new currency. Oh my god, bro, they need so much subscriptions. Added gold coins, the purpose of gold coin to redeem VIP. Oh, bro, damn. We'll need to check out all of this, fix the graphic, okay, fix the gyroscope, alright. So let's just go ahead and open Egg and a Simulator and see what's up. User agreement, okay. What the heck is it saying? Egg and a isn't optimized for latest version of Android. Screen touches may be delayed or not recognized, bro. 2.2 star rating. So the rating has fallen down, guys. <laughs> Earlier it was 2.4 star, now it's 2.2 star. <laughs> <laughs> so let's just go ahead and open again a simulator. I like to make videos on again because it's funny bro. Take a look at this. The touch controls are not working on these two. Not worth it. <laughs> I actually wanted to take a look at its change log guys. I'm not even going to lie. So guys on the official website of again a simulator the version 3.1.6 does exist. Fix the problem that login page input method did not respond. Oh bro I understand now. So it was a bug all along. Now I have successfully updated again a simulator. Let's just go ahead and open it. Click on don't allow, click on allow, alright. I'll just go ahead and create a brand new account to see if there are any ongoing events of Agena Simulator. On the registration page of Agena Simulator, you'll see that the VIP event is still ongoing, I guess. We still received the event gift of Agena Simulator. I'll just go ahead and log in now. Alright, what's this? Sign in for 7 days to get gold coin. This is day 4, sign in now. Okay, let's just go ahead and click here. We got 10 golden coins. Alright, let's close again a simulator. Let me go to the VIP section. Gold coin exchange, okay. The weak card, alright. Everything is similar. Gold coin. One day VIP for 100 gold coins, okay. The again a simulator has now went from being an emulator to if I must say complicated garbage. So let me just go ahead and go to game settings. Add my storage. And here we go, all the games are loaded. Let's just go ahead and try playing Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild with touch controls. And as I was saying, it's so complicated now. Again, a simulator has went from being an emulator app to just an app which requires payment every two seconds, which is truly not worth it at all. And I have been getting many comments from you guys telling me that I need to get a low end device. Like I get so many comments. You guys are like, bro, test it on Snapdragon 660. The truth is that I only have flagship devices now. My Galaxy F41, which I used for creating creating low-end device videos is done for now it needs to be repaired so I don't have any low-end devices anymore that is the problem which I am facing you guys comment down and tell me to test on low-end devices but I actually don't have a low-end device now let me know in the comment section down below do you want me to buy a low-end device because I am thinking that <laughs> it would be more profitable for me to make videos on low-end devices than to use actual high-end devices just so I can relate to you guys current situation like Snapdragon 890 device I can probably get it for like $100 so let me know in the comment section which low-end device should I buy guys I am asking you guys so yeah uh, with that being said the again a simulator version 3.1.6 update appears to be working somewhat fine uh, this is Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild and it's pretty cool. I won't show the full gameplay. It will take a lot of time. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching. Make sure like and subscribe. Goodbye.